The Seoul Central District Prosecutor's Office says it has secured evidence that suggests former President Park Geun-hye had a hand in creating the infamous cultural blacklist that was used to hinder the careers of thousands of cultural figures in Korea deemed critical of her administration. Based on this new evidence, which has... Uh, was not given in the first cultural blacklist trial last July. Judges on Tuesday increased the sentences of several former officials of the Park and Hay administration. Former presidential chief of staff Kim Ki Chun had his sentence increased to four years, and former culture minister Jo Yun Sun had her sentence increased to two years.